A 16 year old girl says she was lured here to East Park on Friday by a good friend. When she arrived, she says she was confronted and beaten by several other girls. The beating captured on video is graphic. Taylor Postawade is confronted by the group under a pavilion. Soon the fight starts and then turns into a mob beating. Postawade is on the ground, punched, kicked, and stomped in the head and chest repeatedly. This is Postawade's face Monday night. It is covered with bruises and fractures. She and her family watched the video after it was posted to social media. I was all tightened up while I was watching it and I like squinted my eyes like I couldn't because it was me. I couldn't finish watching it. It was very sad. I bawled. I called my dad. I was absolutely appalled. I could not continue watching the whole video. A closer look at the video. The first time at least two girls kick and stomp her in the face simultaneously. Later on, one of the girls uses her foot to deliver another smashing blow to Pasta White's head. I have a fractured, like all the bones in here are shattered. I also have a broken nose and a concussion. Pasta White's family says she needs surgery and they are filled with outrage. Held her down and stomped on her face like that. And, and then as they were walking away, complained that, they, that, that, that she had gotten blood on them. These girls came down there, six, seven of them, to beat up one, one person. They took this video of themselves committing this crime and posted it on Facebook and YouTube. But the matter is now in the hands of the Connellsville Police Department. The update from the Connellsville Police Chief is that they're still working the investigation, but they expect to make several arrests very soon, including teenagers and adults. In Connellsville, Sheldon Ingram, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.